Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is the final boarding call for all remaining guests travelling to Rockhampton today on flight VA1243, the scheduled 12.45 p.m. service. Boarding for the service will close shortly. We ask all guests to please proceed directly to gate 46. Thank you. Time for another adventure. Good morning from beautiful Barmara in South Australia. Barmara is right on this little lake called Lake Bonnie. It's a landscape photographer's dream. You've got all these dead trees in the water that surround the lake. Now the reason why those trees are dead is because over the years the salinity in the water has increased from agricultural runoff and really severe drought. So the salt had got down into the roots and killed all these trees terrible for the trees but it also makes for phenomenal photographic material. So for those of you who don't know, Barmer is about 200 k's out from Adelaide, the capital of South Australia. It's about three hours drive and it's a beautiful drive out through the country. Now South Australia is famous for its wine regions. You've got the Barossa Valley. So the great thing for me is I've got an entire week here and I can't wait a whole week. See, normally I go to spots and I only spend like two or three days and get around and get my photography. But this time I've got a complete week. A week! I'm gonna do a bit of a recce. I'm gonna drive around the whole lake now and hopefully find some spots for good spots for sunrises, sunsets, and of course the Milky Way. So please, join me. My first stop is this place uh, just that I found on the other side of the lake called Pelican Point. Now I'm hoping to find a really good spot to do a sunrise shoot. And by the looks of it, yeah, I think I've found a pretty good spot. Really remote. I don't think anyone will be here at all. In terms of uh, sunrise locations, I think this is going to be it for me. I found this wonderful old tree out here, full of character. Incredible lines are from the bark. And I've used my Photo Pills app to locate where the sun's going to come up. Now, the thing that I like about this particular spot right here on Lake Bonnie is that I can really use my 16 to 35 mil lens on wide and I can really isolate that shot. Go for a long exposure maybe with the cloud and the sky moving through. Look, I could do a shot right now, middle of the day, and could have a black and white shot. But I'm gonna use this as a sunrise location. It's really good. Now, the other thing that I'm really excited about is not only that type of frame that I can get with this tree, it's also, there's another frame here. I can use that stump there as a bit of foreground interest leading into that tree. And then I've got my sun coming up over there. So, yep, mark this one for a sunrise for sure. beautiful, crisp, clear, some whiffs of cloud in the sky. They are just drifting over into my shot now, but it is so beautiful and still at the moment. It's wonderful, so quiet. 
can see the birds waking up now and just going out for their early morning feed on the lake. So I'm back here now, I'm back at that position that I found. You know, I'm, I'm framed at the moment where I've got a bit of foreground interest with this bit of dead wood in front of me here and um, some reeds type of thing on the right hand side of my frame and then I've got my beautiful tree on the left hand side of frame. I've already checked where the sun's coming up with my photo pills at. It's basically going to come up right in between them so um, hopefully, hopefully I can just get a little bit of cloud in the sky but hey, it doesn't matter if it doesn't. It's such a beautiful spot. What a great morning to be alive. Okay, so it's not too far before the sun comes up over the horizon now. Just for those interested, I've got my 16 to 35 mil lens on. I'm set at 24 mil. I'm at ISO 64 f11. And I'm going to drop in a, uh, a three stop medium grad just to take the edge off the sky. Anyway, I better finish getting set up and I'll talk to you in a little bit. So the sun's up now. That was a great sunrise, really beautiful. I ended up having to move quickly um, because I actually found another frame right beside me where, where I had this wonderful structure of a dead tree right next to me here and I've put that in the foreground. I've got bird life just surrounding me right now. As I speak, I'm just looking here, beautiful galah just sitting on top of the uh, the log just right here. So thanks very much for watching, I really appreciate having you along. Hope you enjoyed the video. Always feel free to subscribe to my channel. But for now, oh, for now, I'm knackered. I'm going home, I'm gonna have a bit of a sleep, a bit of food, and then yeah, I'll uh, get up a bit later and maybe go and see what the sunset's doing.